Hey guys, it's Jen from Generator 74, and I got a box in the mail today. I've already cut the tape off of it um, and took out the uh, sheet that says what's in here. Um, keep flashing my address all over the internet. <laughs> Anyway, um, yeah, they had some things um, that I had been looking for from long ago and a few other things I'd never seen before that I know are older. I mean, they carry, like, older things. That's how they can, you know, offer them at such cheap prices. And you only have to spend $20 to get free shipping, which is fabulous. Um, the box is a little beat up, so we'll see if everything's okay in here or not. Um... But yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and open this here and see what we have. I just placed this order Wednesday. It's now Friday and it's here already. So they have super fast shipping. And um, that's always a welcome situation. <laughs> so let's see. All right. Now, we have some stickers. These are alphabet stickers. They're fancy pants. Um, I just thought they were cute because I like the colors, the red, the orange, the brown, green and blue together. Um, they're not my favorite font, but I thought that um, I could actually trim off this if I wanted to just to make it a square letter. So they were only a dollar. How can you say no to that? Um, let's see. I'll never remember all of the prices. The uh, doo -doo -doo, fancy pants. Okay, these are also fancy pants. These are just stickers. Um, really need to be more organized. About a girl here. These were a dollar. I thought so. And so were these a dollar. Um, so I'll show you these. I mean a dollar? Yes please. <laughs> Super cute. Love the colors. Muted. Pretty. And then these little um, these are from Fancy Pants too. Little flowers. There's 36 pieces in here, and I love the colors in here too. Um, orange, gray, green, blue. I'm not going to give you the prices on all this stuff because honestly, just go to scrapbook.com and check it out because um, they have really great deals. And these are basic gray um, clips. And these are from... Um, life of the party. I don't actually have this paper, but I really like these clips, so I went ahead and got them, because you wouldn't have to use them just with that paper line. I mean, they have colors in them that could go with lots of things. And I do have this paper line. This is from a long time ago, too. More basic gray, and these are from uh, the... Why doesn't it say it on here? Is it the Marjolaine... I'm not sure why it doesn't say it on there, but that's what these are from. So I got those to add to my um, the paper that I have. I have the 12 by 12 collection, but I haven't used it yet, honestly, because I've been hoarding it because I love the colors. Um, I already had a pack of these that I ordered last time, but I went ahead and got another one because they were only $2, and I really liked the color, and I really liked the size. So, um, and the font is just very plain, and I like that. And then they had the blue um, this time, so I just went ahead and got two of those because I knew I liked the font and the, and the size and everything, and the color is super pretty, too, and those are from Fancy Pants as well. And then I got two packs of these tiny little letters from Making Memories. Um, there's 468 pieces in each. This one's a black with white type, and this one's like a light pink sort of ledger um, with black print on it. And there are a lot of them in there, so cute. And then I got this paper, um, I believe it's called Ginger Snap. I really love brown. <laughs> um, 
and this is a nice sort of um, lighter reddish brown that I think will go well with um, lots of colors. Uh, so I went ahead and got a pack of this. There were 25 pieces of 12 by 12 for two bucks. And then I also ordered some more paper and some letters. I had gotten um, a similar sheet of these craft craft cuts from Fancy Pants Letters. They were only a dollar a sheet. Um, the other page I got was like a blue and a green, and this is like a blue and a gray, kind of. Um, but again, I like that font. It's very plain, sort of boxy, good size for layouts. And then I got a bunch of, well not a bunch, but some 12 by 12. <clears throat> Excuse me, my voice. From um, mostly, I think it was paper, um, basic gray. This is from Sugar Rush. I mean, again, this is really old, but I don't have this, and I really liked it. Um, this is Sugar Rush as well, basic gray. This is the side that I liked there. This is another Sugar Rush. It's pretty. I really like the dots. And this is um, Scarlet's letter. I like that distressed. Love it. These are single-sided. Periphery. It's just distressed, like a real pale blue. Single-sided. It's another periphery sheet. This is Merlot. And I do this on some of my layouts. I just I um, either ink up or put paint on like a plastic cup, and I just put it on there. Now this is a little fancier because it's got swirlies and things, but it's the same idea. And this is another periphery. This is the um, vineyard. Love that. I mean, these together are awesome. So they would make a really pretty layout. Um, Max and Whiskers. The only thing I have from this collection is the chipboard stickers, and I got those at Big Lots, I believe. Big Lots or Ollie's? No, Big Lots. Um, for like three bucks. So I got a few pieces of paper. Um, I won't be using this for myself, um, most likely. Um, well, you never know. I might finish. I don't know. Um, yeah, don't really want to get into that, but we don't have any animals here anymore, and um, I'm not sure that we will be anytime soon, but um, but I really like this paper. I like the colors, um, and it wouldn't have to be used for an animal layout. This side or this side is the blue. This is another sheet from that same collection. I like those. The colors go. That little dot here is this color, so that's pretty. And then the other side um, has little bones on it, which is cute. I mean, I have pictures that I do need to scrapbook of Emma, our um, schnauzer that we lost back in February, but um, it's just really painful to do <laughs> her layouts right now. So hopefully it'll get easier. Um, this paper is another basic gray. This is infused. I just really liked the color and the design of the distress on this. And this is another sheet from Infuse. It's called Salt, and it looks like it goes really well with it. So I think I could use those together on a layout. And these are from Green at Heart. And I already had a few sheets of this um, that I had bought on sale somewhere before. And so I went ahead and picked up these two sheets. I didn't have these. These are single-sided. Um, that one's cutesy. Not necessarily my style, but I really like this one with the distressed stripes. And then the same thing here I had already, um, well I had bought a 6x6 and some coordinating pieces like chipboard stickers and things, um, cardstock stickers, sorry. But I like these two sheets because this is like a craft large, like a 12x12 12 12 of the ledger in the craft color. And then this is just a little polka dot. So I went ahead and got that because I thought they went well together. And all together, for all of that, I spent $27.90. I got free shipping. Um, so yeah, I uh, 
really liked it. I'm going to have to go through here and make sure that everything's here because it just seems like there's a lot more on the sheet than what was in the box, but um, yeah, I really, I really like scrapbook.com and again, they have older, you know, less recent items, but they have them at like phenomenal prices. So go check them out. Thanks for watching and I hope to get some more videos loaded soon. See ya. Hey guys, um, I just wanted to follow up and let you know that I did check through my order sheet and everything that I ordered was there. Um, so I didn't want to leave you with any negative thoughts um, about scrapbook.com because all of my orders have come in full. Um, thus far, I have gotten free shipping after $20. They have come undamaged um, and very, very quickly. Uh, again, I ordered on Wednesday and got them on Friday. And I live in Pennsylvania and they ship from, I don't even remember, a totally different state. Uh, doesn't say on the sheet, doesn't say it on the box. Boy. They're shipping from, is that Michigan? M something. It's hard to read on the label, but I think it's Michigan. So yeah, cool, right? All right. Thanks. Talk to you later. Bye.